Hello everybody. I would like to spend a couple of minutes uh, talking about avascular necrosis or osteonecrosis or also known as bone death. This is a condition that occurs in a bone when the blood supply to that particular part is obstructed or cut off. It can occur in different parts of the body like the head of the humerus, the scaphoid, the talus and couple of other places. But the most commonest part is the uh, head of the femur that has this particular condition called avascular necrosis. Avascular necrosis is occurring because of the unique nature of the blood supply to that particular part of the bone. Once this blood supply is obstructed or cut off and the blood supply to that is obstructed, then the part degenerates or necrosis or dies. So the terminology osteonecrosis or bone death. Indeed, we have uh, these conditions uh, prevailing ever since the human being has been there. But we should also know the causes for the cause of avascular necrosis. Trauma or injury to the blood vessels that carry the blood supply to that particular part of the bone. Or sometimes because of certain diseases like uh, sickle cell anemia, Gaucher's disease, in certain uh, conditions like alcohol abuse, diabetics, long term use of steroids and non sterile anti inflammatory drugs. The latest hum in the uh, field is because of a burst or a spike in the number of cases of avascular necrosis that have been reported recently after the COVID in fall. In COVID, the basic management or the baseline of management has been the use of steroids for long term and high doses of steroids. Long term steroids and high doses of steroids prevent or obstruct the blood supply to the head of the femur or that particular part of the bone. Why does steroid affect the blood supply? We are not sure, but there is a hypothesis that the lipids increase in the blood level and they cause clogging of the vessels that supply blood to that part of the bone. So this uh, latest uh, pandemic of uh, COVID-19 and the use of steroids in these patients have led to a spike in the condition called avascular necrosis, osteonecrosis or bone death. So can we prevent it? Unfortunately, no, because we have to save lives by using the use of steroids for long duration and in high doses. Of course, we can prevent uh, the damage if it is recognized very early by operative methods like core decompression. In later cases, when it is uh, identified at a later stage, we have to salvage the procedure or we have to do a hip replacement surgery. So, this is in short about avascular necrosis, osteonecrosis are also known as bone death. Thank you.